In this video, we're gonna tell you seven reasons why you should not get a Belgian Malinois. If you don't know what a Belgian Malinois is, they're strong, powerful, high energy dogs that make great dogs for police, military, or specific jobs. They're intelligent and they can do just about anything. But if you're looking for a family dog, maybe this one's not best for you. Or if you don't have the time, energy, or space, you may consider another dog. So in this video, we're gonna take you through seven reasons why the Belgian Malinois probably isn't right for you. If you're new to our channel, welcome. We make dog videos that are educational and entertaining. So let's get started with the number one reason. The number one reason is this dog has high energy. The Belgian Malinois is an extreme working dog that can do just about any job. They can jump high, run fast, and this dog isn't for everyone because of it. They are elite of the elite. So if you're looking for a nice family dog to run around the backyard, this dog is not it. They need specific jobs and they require a lot of exercise because they have a lot of energy, both mental and physical energy that needs to be burned up. So if you don't have the time or energy to keep up with their energy, then the Belgian Malinois is not a dog for you. The number two reason, they have an enthusiasm to train. So if you don't have the time or energy to give them constant training for both their mind and body, this dog is not for you. It's why you see this dog part of police and military is because they love a job, they love to be part of a team, and this dog will go to the ends of the earth with its bravery for its owner. So in order to own this dog, you need to be dedicated to them 100% and it takes a lot of time and a lot of energy. So if you're not home a lot of the time or this dog is just left out in the backyard, you're gonna have a lot of problems and a lot of headaches and it may not be the best dog for you. The number three reason, this dog is strong and powerful. The Belgian Malinois is used in police and military to jump high, climb things, run fast, and do just about anything. They're a super dog, so if you think you're gonna take this dog for a leisurely walk, it could be very challenging for you as they're really strong, could pull on the leash, jump over your fences at home. They can do so many things that most dogs just cannot do. So if you're considering a Belgian Malinois, just know that they're very strong very smart and can escape from areas, jump over things, and could really get away from you if you leave them in the backyard and expect them to just stay back there. So the Belgian Malinois needs to be respected and because they are strong and powerful. The number four reason why the Belgian Malinois may not be best for you is because they are extremely smart. So like we said earlier, they need intense training and they need a space to entertain and educate their active mind. They need to be trained and told what to do. And if you don't have the time or energy to do this, this dog will become restless, anxious, and cause a lot of damage to your property. There'll be a big headache if you don't give them the mental stimulation that they need. This is why they are part of police and military. Like we said before, police and military are always training them, working with them, and if you can't do this, this dog is definitely not for you. The number five reason why the Belgian Malinois is not for you is because they need a ton of space. This dog needs to run, play, and exercise up to three to four hours a day. So it will not be enough to just let your dog out in the backyard and hope they're okay. Instead, you need to play with them and give them a ton of space to run and burn off the energy. Like we said earlier, they're very strong as well. So if you can't give them the space to run and run off all that energy, they will be a huge headache for you as they'll cause damage to your house, yard, and even start to get aggressive towards you with all of that pent up energy. So if you don't have the space, if you live in an apartment, this dog is not for you. At number six, the Belgian Malinois sheds and they shed a lot. We've spent a lot of time talking about how strong, powerful, smart, and how much, how much exercise requirements they need. But we can't forget that this dog also sheds. So if you are allergic or you don't like fur on your furniture, clothes, floor, 
then this dog might not be best for you. Instead, you may look at a hypoallergenic dog like a poodle mix or a straight poodle. But the Belgian Malinois with its combination of size, strength, and athletic ability combined with the fact that it sheds, you need to know this as well and it may not be the best dog for you. The number seven reason why the Belgian Malinois is probably not good for you is they get big. So when you get this dog as a cute puppy, just know that it can get big. This dog can get up to 80 pounds and it's not 80 pounds of fluff. This will be 80 pounds of muscle and strength and it will be hard for you to manage them at times if you're not ready. So if you wanna take a dog on a nice leisurely walk, maybe the Belgian Malinois is not for you. Or if you wanna cuddle inside your house with a dog, maybe the Belgian Malinois isn't for you because of their size, strength, and their need to exercise and be outside and be active. So we hope this video has helped you understand that the Belgian Malinois, while an awesome dog and right for the right person, may not be best for you. We'll see you on the next video.